Hello and welcome, my goofy goobers. How you doing today? We're heading out into Coolin Springs today. This is the beach area. Well, it's actually it's a bit of a it's a bit of a weird area to be honest. With. I don't know why we really start on a beach. <laughs> Doesn't make sense to me, but hey, I'm going with it. Let's go with the flow, guys. This one's sort of a wide open area. It's not hard, but just because it's so big, you can kind of get a little bit lost in uh, nowhere to go. So in this guide, what I'm going to do is I'm going to show you guys where all th uh, four puzzle pieces are and the two artifacts as well. So uh, we're going to show you how to get that real quick. Here's our first puzzle piece. Just as soon as you walk in, just directly to the right. Second puzzle piece is going to be... Oh, look at these guys trying to take me down, man. I'm going to say no way. You ain't getting me not today. Uh, second puzzle piece is going to be a little bit of a platformer. Just jump on a couple platforms if you're good. And you make it over here, and we're going to grab our s artifact. Oh, sorry, sorry, not a puzzle piece. Artifact. Uh, then we're going to hop on over um, to the other side, basically. Oh, my God. A lot of things to kill you in this, man. That's, that's for sure. A lot of things to kill you. So there's also a weird little place where you can get some fun little coins in there, but that's not all that important. Instead, we're, we're going to say, oh, we're going to go near this guy, and we're going to turn to the left. Nice hidden thing with Bob for us, but we got to watch out for this guy for sure. He can easily take you down, man. Yeah, there's so many things in here that can actually kill you, not just, like, knock you down. Like, they're not far for you to go, but it's just weird to see. So, um, next thing we're going to do is we're going to kill a couple guys real quick. Just kind of get them out of my way here. I'm going to go for our another puzzle piece all the way in the back left corner over here. Just keep on jumping, keep on hopping. I love his little, love his little hoop, man. It's so cute. It's so cute. Astro. Keep him going. So I always thought there was going to be some sort of secret weird thing going on with this giant blob, right? Like, why? Why does it break down? Like, what do I do with all these little heads here? Nothing. I know, I know. Nothing. It's weird to see, but that's the way it is. And this is going to lead us to another artifact here. Just kind of a giant circle is all you really need to do here. Go all the way across, pull some things out of the ground. Uh, you grab the puzzle pieces and you're totally freaking set here, boys. Last one, though. All right. We're going to hop up over here. To get to it, you got to hop in an umbrella, jump across the other jump point, and whoop, you get your thing. Just to double check to make sure everything's here. Four out of four and two. All right. Absolutely perfect. And to finish it off, all you got to do is walk straight through this center windy area, man. I got to say, it feels pretty cool. Like, I like the controller aspect. One thing I do notice about this game, though, is that it sucks the juice out of your controller, man. I and mean, it kind of makes sense. There's so much stuff going on making noises and vibrations and, um, you know, actually, like, pushing back against me with, like, my R2 and everything, but just kind of wild overall. So let's get to finish up our first area here. Don't forget to press that like and subscribe if you guys enjoyed this content. I'd really appreciate it. it makes me feel good and juicy on the inside here, guys. Thanks so much. And of course, have a super duper. Stay.